On this episode of Living the Dream, we rejoin Jimmy and Louisa and the guys from Fishing Florida Charters for a snapper sleigh day offshore from the plantation on Crystal River. What? That's a big one. That's a big boy. That's a mangrove snapper right there, son. Good first fish of the day, Steve. Got some slabs coming up. Going straight in the grizzly. Oh, I got an African pompano. No Look way. at that. Now talk about a pretty little guy. There's that lane. First one of these today. All day long. Got lane snappers, yellowtail snappers, hogfish, mangrove snappers, triggerfish, all kinds of stuff in there. Last week, Jimmy and Louisa joined up with Laramie and Garrett from Fishing Florida Charters and headed about 140 miles offshore. While the target for the day is snapper, a mixture of just about everything is coming into the boat. Holy cow, look at that gag. That's a Louisa <laughs> fish right there. Yes. Holy smoot. Now we rejoin the gang for some non-stop action. You guys see this? You think it's a group or a snapper? It's a snapper. It's a snapper. Go left. Actually, I'll, I'll go left so I can grab it here because it's easy. Oh. oh, is that a snapper or is that a tile fish? That's oh, a grouper. It's a gag, dude. It's a oh, gag. And that's oh, why, that's why wait, I see, who caught it? Who caught it? It's on my line. All right. Mm. There's the gag. OK. And just like that giant red grouper Steve caught, this is out of season two. <laughs> Man, stud. Getting 33 inch grouper. Man, what a way to start. That wore me out. <laughs> Little Florida fishing right here, guys. So this one, I'm not gonna try to release them like the other one. I'm going to put them on this guy here that Garrett has. And tell us how that works, Garrett. So I got set on 150 feet right here. And once the lead takes the fish down to 150 feet, he will pop right off. Look at that, and there he goes. Yeah, that grouper's just going down. He stuck all those swordfish leads on there to help pull him down. And like he said, he's got it set to 150 feet, so the clip just pops, and the grouper swims off. Something we definitely can't do from up here on the boat, just get that fish down 150 feet to release it. Five pounds of lead to get that fish to go down. Five pounds, <laughs> that's a lot of lead. <laughs> yeah, he did. Oh, don't lose that one, there's your gag. <laughs> Oh, look at that. It's a nice snatch. It's a Kubera. No, it's not. It's a big old mango, son. Oh, my gosh. Let me help you with that. That's a mangrove snapper right there, son. Good first fish of the day, Steve. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Beast, bro. All right, let's get this in the grizzly. Woo Here we go again. What you got? Oh, I don't know yet. But if I were to guess, probably a grouper. Red one. There's a fish. Leader. The yeah. Because I don't see it, but he's here somewhere. 
Oh yeah, it's a red grouper. And I think I have somebody else's line. No? Big red grouper. Big one. Man, this is the red bigger. grouper hole. Got a nice red grouper here. Going back in the water. There he goes. Live in the Dream with Captain Jimmy Nelson is made possible by Salt Life, Live Salty. Grizzly Coolers, Envision, Engineered and Perfected for Performance. Decant, Never Compromise, Demand the Best. And by Plantation on Crystal River, the place to stay and play along Florida's nature coast. Nestled in the tributaries of Florida's nature coast, the plantation on Crystal River is the perfect getaway for your entire family, with an abundance of activities for every interest. For the outdoorsy person, water-based activities like scalloping on the inshore flats or watching and enjoying the local wildlife are must-dos while in Crystal River. For those interested to relax around the resort, the plantation features a heated in-ground pool with a poolside bar, its own fully equipped gym, and an in-house spa perfect to let all your cares melt away. And for the avid golfer in your family, the plantation on Crystal River boasts its own 27-hole championship golf course within walking distance of your room. The course was designed in classic Florida styling and features challenging fairways and 53 bunkers set amongst the picturesque landscape of the Crystal River area. Wildlife abounds and you're sure to have a memorable round regardless of your score. No matter what kind of vacation you're looking for, the plantation on Crystal River has something for everyone in your family. For more information, visit plantationoncrystalriver.com. Back on the water, the drag continues to peel. Mmm. Man, he attacked it like a freaking grouper. That's not a hog, that's a big old trigger. My gosh. No, it's a mangrove. It's wow. a nice mangrove. We'll take it. That's just a tough one. Came in with authority. spot about 20 minutes. It's cooler starting to fill up nicely. These guys. Fish on. Oh, it's a hog. Oh, it's, it's a yellowtail. It's a yellowtail. <laughs> I was just talking about good it. Job. Oh my god. There you go. Softer. It's always nice to see yellowtail on the boat. Got that right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know what we're eating tonight. Super tasty. Feels like a good one, huh, Steve? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's a big corgi. It's a trigger fish. It's a nice trigger fish, it looks like. Yeah, it is. Good job. They're tough, man. The triggers are strong fish. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. You got a ways to go. Well, you got color. That's a good fish. Right? That's a good fish. Yeah. Oh, you got a. So come over here, Jim. Look at this. Walk it over here, Laramie. Look at this. Oh, this is, that's not a keeper. We can toss that one. Yeah, good job. Well, there you go. He's got one right there behind you. Oh, a mangrove. Oh my gosh. Bring him over here. What? That's a big one. 
That's a big boy. This one needs no measurement. Yeah, I'm losing fingers here. I got it. Okay. Beautiful fish. That's a good one, Louisa. That's a monster. Damn. You want to hand with him? He looks like he inhaled that. How do we get it? It's on the side. So you got get it. The... Oh, you got it. Okay. Wait, I'm going to give him a little flip, okay? Actually, I don't got a good hold to do that. I'm going to switch that. Oh. Yeah. Look at the size of this mangrove. Woo! Going straight in the grizzly. Gosh, look at that. It's right on top of that Kubera. Oh, uh, it is. Looks like a big Kubera. Yeah. Oh my goodness. You need a hand? You got it. Wow. Yeah, Steve. Dude, that's a beast. Just a little gag. Bad again. Can't keep them, so send them home. That's why I had my bail open. Let him run a second. Might be another mangrove. He's kind of fighting like a mangrove. No color yet. And another hog fish, and it's a hog. No, it's a mangrove. It is a mangrove. Oh, nice one. But he was fighting like too. Fifteen inches. Got him. Filling up nicely. Filling up real nicely. Got done, Jim. Look at this. Nice. Yeah. Steve's got one right behind you. Oh. Makes me sad. Look at this. Look at what I found in the ocean. My friend, the gag grouper. He's going down though. Not in season. It's pulling. Here we go. It's a mangrove. Oh, it's a lane. Look at that. It's a big old lane snapper. Heck yeah. It's nice to add to the box. Let me show you guys what we got in the wreck. We're about to throw another layer of ice on it. We've been layering our fish as we're putting them in. And there's that lane. First one of these today. Again, these only have to be eight inches long, and that's way over the size. And look how much red we have in here right now. We got lane snappers, yellowtail snappers, hogfish, mangrove snapper, triggerfish, all kinds of stuff in there. We would have caught our gag limit about five times over, as well as our red drooper limit with no problem. But uh, unfortunately, they're closed this time of year, so. No go on those, just snapper. Is it a good one? There you go. Nice. Number 99 today. So much fun pulling these bad boys in one after another. Ooh, trigger. Trigger. <laughs> this bad boy gave me a nice bite. Fishing Florida Charters, thank you very much. Here we go. Nice. And a trigger. As fast as yours is going, and another one's coming up. Big enough. Flying fish. You ever seen a fly? School of gags down there. School's in session. Gosh. 
already. <laughs> Ooh. Man, they're just coming in. I got one coming up over here too, Jim. Looks like a hog, I think. No, it's a mangrove. It's another nice mangrove. Another keeper. They're everywhere, guys. Everywhere. And if I didn't say it earlier, you're allowed 10 of these per person, 60 per boat. And these guys usually limit out on them. They do real well. Mm. That's about as tasty as you're going to get. Almost out. I'm going to let them go. Look at that, Jimbo. There you go. A little bloody. I got him right on the lip. I got him on a carotid artery. <laughs> Look at him. Heck yeah, mine's a little bloody too. All right, well this one gets to go in the grizzly. He's trying to get away, but we're not going to let him. Double up. Yeah, I'm Laramie. Let's go, buddy. You mean tripled up. Yeah, tripled up. Gosh, this is a pretty good one. I think I got another mangrove. Here it is. Here it is. I got color. I think I got a porgy. No, I got an African pompano. No Look way. at that. A little wow. African pompano. How about that? I'm going to drop a live bait. Maybe we'll get a big one. Look at this here. Now talk about a pretty little guy. Pretty fish. It's not every day that we catch an African pompano out here out of Crystal River. Very nice fish, but small. So we're gonna let him go and look at this mangrove right here. Oh my god, oh, and a gag right over here too. This is crazy. This is so crazy. So many fish. Triple. All right, guys. Talk about a cool triple, a mangrove, a gag, and an African pompano, which is a big surprise out here on the bottom. Yeah, still got his streamers. Those will disappear when he becomes an adult. Nice catch, nice careful. Me and Jim's is going back. Yeah. I'm taking mine home. You're taking yours home. <laughs> there home. There you go. Heck yeah. All right. Good job, bud. There he goes. Pretty little fish. That's pretty neat. You guys can also catch African pompano with these guys. Unexpected. Got some slabs coming up. I'm gonna call mangrove snapper. See, it is a, it's a mangrove, no, it's a lane. Another oh my lane. Oh, that's beauty. Got another good one. The other one's a little bigger than this one, but this one's still plenty big enough. While we were getting ready to leave, dropped down a big old squirrel fish. And up coming about a five pound mangrove. Nice. If this is another lane, it's gonna be huge. It's getting bigger every time I draw. Wow, you got one, you got a mangrove. Mangrove. This is crazy. Wow, yours is still. Yeah, I got a good one. Good job, Louisa. I think I got a big lane. No, I got a big mangrove. Big yeah. mangrove. The parents of mine. What? You're not kidding, look at this. It's just showing off now. Yeah, they're uh, they're biting all right. I could tell the weight picked it up. It was a little better. I think I got a good mangrove here. Just pulled in a nice vermilion. Let's see, maybe another one. Oh, and it oh. Is. No, oh, it's yeah. a lane. I mean, another lane. Nice. Take a few of these. Such pretty fish. Look at the colors in them and the stripes. It's like just so lit up. And the pinks in the tail. One of the prettier snapper out here. We've covered most of our fish in ice, but you can see a couple real pretty ones right on top there. Nah, it's not a real big one. But I have a feeling we got a keeper here. Mm, but it's a nope. It's a trigger. Look how close my finger is to his mouth. That could have been a mistake. I haven't even showed you guys these triggers yet today and why they call them trigger fish. I've just been tossing them in. You see how he's moving that trigger down? No matter what you do, that thing will not bend down. You will break it if you try to put it down. But if you just touch the trigger, 
go straight down. Just like that, but that will not. That's why they call them a trigger fish. Super tough skin, little doll knives. But they're fantastic to eat. Woo! They just keep coming in. You're a fish magnet. <clears throat> Might be another lane. That would be awesome. I would, that's my fourth lane. It is. Wow. What? Fourth lane, three in a row. Crazy. Did you get one? Dude, they're here. It's just the right time of day, the lanes are turning on, and these are just chunks, man. God, what a slab. Whoo! Well, guys, we're still pulling them in. We've been pulling them in since we got out here. And unfortunately, we're running out of time because we've got to go back to the plantation and eat dinner. Thanks again for joining us for another amazing day out here with Fish in Florida Charters, catching snapper and hogfish and probably about five boat limits of grouper that we let go. Another big old mangrove. Just been an absolutely amazing day out here. Thanks again for joining us and I'll see you next week, same place, same time for more big fish fighting action. For more fishing and diving action, follow Captain Jimmy on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, Twitter, and TikTok at Captain Jimmy Nelson.